Is it man-to-man? Is it in a zone? Hawks are in the blue as the defending champs. The Lancers are in the all-white. It will take them a quarter or so to kind of acclimate to the surroundings here at the Ocean First Bank Center. Katie Hill cover her, and Hill drove right past her, and here's a steal and another opportunity for the Lady Lancers. Quickly down court, that is the super sophomore, Madison St. Rose. Deflected by St. Rose. Gets past Bray. Easy layup on the right side, and the run for Vianney continues. The jumper. Another one, and it's going to be a timeout for Dave Bolcheman. Quickly up court. Adams driving and getting on the board this year. And Dakota Adams, who was a perfect role player, oh, inside boy, player. Was she ever. Three online for O'Connor. Five turnovers. And we're still in the first quarter. Adams, good move in the paint. Gets her own rebound back. And lays it in. Thought about the shot. 20 in the first quarter. Good help coming over the top. And then the force jumper is good from Gabriella Ross, the 5'7 freshman. Run it down in the corner. Is trapped. Skip. Extra pass. The look for Ross is good. Ice water in the veins so far for the freshman in the second quarter. Wide open for Katie Hill. She'll drill it. The high school line for our games tonight. Yeah. St. Rose, another steal. Up court, good outlet for Bruin. Blocked away by Adams. Backdoor cut, the catch, and the finish for Cahallon. That's just how you draw it up. Three online from Adams. St. John McGinney scoreless the last three and a half minutes. Manchester the last two and a half minutes. That will change with a long distance bomb from Serenity Anderson. Manchester trying to win back to back titles. St. Rose makes it so difficult. She goes right down the lane. Manchester, the two seed in the tournament, has not led so far tonight. Anderson ties it up at 24. Adams will flash out. Take the three and hit first lead of the night for Manchester. St. Rose trying to answer back. Battling inside, Cahallon and one. Two-point game right now for Vianney. St. Rose sealing off Velez. A few players per side with two, but nobody has reached that third foul yet. Here's Velez driving. Good move. That is what Manchester's been waiting for. St. Rose uses the screen beautifully down the lane on the left side. St. Rose through traffic. Wide open look for Bruin, who got lost in traffic. Velez flipping it up and getting it to go. And she's capable of. Wow, that was a dipsy doodle. Right back the other direction, Vianney. Open look from Whitehead off the bench. All of a sudden, we've got points. Down on the floor, and here comes Katie Hill with a three on two. Down the lane, counted in one. Oh, what a big basket that was. The four-minute mark of the fourth quarter. Inside St. Rose. On Velez. Smooth move from the sophomore. Velez stopping. Handing off Adams. Four-point game. Adams down the lane, making a two-point game. Some full-court pressure. I'm going to 
know how she got out of that, but Adams did. Don't know either, and a beautiful spin move. Keeps it alive in one. All right, so let me just put it on my back, and I'll take you home, because that's exactly what Destiny Adams did there. Two minutes left. Can the Hawks defend their championship? Can Deani win a record 14th Shore Conference title? St. Rose, the offensive rebound put back. And we've got a foul away from the ball, right? The foul on Reynolds had nothing to do with the play. What a little swing this is going to be. Score the basket. Foul is on Reynolds, as you said. It's going to send Hill to the line for, in essence, a bonus possession for a one and one. Well, look at look at Dawn Carpell jumping up and down. Three years of frustration is about to come to an end. To three different teams: St. Rose in 17, Manasquan in 18, Manchester last year. And this lefty sophomore, who was brilliant on Tuesday night with 36 points, is going to follow that up with another tremendous effort and clearly will be our MVP player of the game. This unveiling, so to speak, of Madison St. Rose is a don't forget the name. Lancer's lucky 13 becomes 14. The 14th Shore Conference Championship in school history doubling up the next best team Neptune with seven congratulations Don Carpell and the rest of the Vienna program